spin no hardcore? What's that? You're not going to spin no hardcore. I, I'm sorry, can you say that again? You're not going to spin no Welcome to my apartment. You're watching the show where I, Jeff Cannibal, interview some of your favorite wrestlers, all while they compete to win five whole dollars. To do this, they'll have to use five wins increasing in heat, all while I have only one beverage. But if they tap out to those five wins, they have to cut a promo on this guy. Felix, my three-legged kitten. You're watching The Flaming Table. Start over. Thank you for joining me today at The Flaming Table. Uh, today brought to you by Bulldozers Collectibles at the Berlin Flea Market. Go there, get everything from WWE to CZW, GCW, and everything in between. Uh, today my guest is uh, all-around actual fucking lunatic, uh, Jimmy Lyon. How are you feeling today? Like I'm about to go to the hospital. Uh, perfect. I think today a lot of the questions are probably going to end with me asking you uh, why. So let's get right into it. First sauce uh, made by fan Boogie Rag Joe. Uh, I'm just going to use whatever he gives me for the first one, as always. And we have a coconut habanero. So let's take our first bite and I'll ask you the first question. I just want to say before I do any of this stuff, I'm terrible with spicy foods. I'm wearing my singlet. So I have something to shit into, so I don't have to put my pants back on because it's a little long car ride. I am. Uh, I also don't want you to shit in my house. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> All right, let's get into it, and I'll ask you the first question. You threw me on a shopping cart before. I was going to the hospital. So one time, you weed whacked a guy who sits in a wheelchair. Why don't you tell us about that? <laughs> this is the first one, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> fuck. I finished the whole wing too. Oh, go fuck yourself. <laughs> So you weed whacked a guy in a wheelchair once. What was that like? Why did you do this? Fuck. Okay. Well, I'm gonna do it without touching that. Okay. It's my friend from um, ACW. Okay. I'm not gonna like this at all. Mm. <laughs> I just want to let you know there's money buried in my backyard that goes to my family. Um, what was the, oh yeah. Good <laughs> start. Shut the fuck up. Okay. Um, it's my friend. It's got muscular dystrophy. I wanted to do something nice. So, <laughs> and he asked me, and I wanted to have a match with him. So I had a match with him. And he asked me to hit him with the weed whacker. I hit him with the weed whacker. Let's just get through this. Oh my Christ. So you had to hit a guy with a weed whacker. Who's yeah. In a and then went us to gimmick it. And he was like, ah, don't bother. So I did it. And Rock and Rebel was the guy there with the license, the commissioner. <laughs> As you spill water all over yourself. Oh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah. And he was gone. So we just did whatever we want. And then my friend choked me out. I have a job to a guy in a wheelchair. And everybody. Cool. As you tend to do. Oh, fuck. Um, oh, God. That was the first one, right? Yeah, should we move on? I'm not... I was going to take our time. I swear. Like, like, oh, I know I'm supposed to be talking in a southern accent and everything. This fucking sucks. I was going to take my time, but I feel like you're you're uh, dying. So ah. we got to kind of rush through the rush. You might die. Uh, our second sauce... Wait, wait. Why am I sweating? Is it? That's going to happen. I, I don't even eat... Oh, my fuck. Welcome to here. Our second sauce is going to be Outer Limits. Uh, they're ghost pepper and roasted garlic sauce. It's a little bit uh, spicier, I believe. So you should do well. You want to continue? Oh, oh fuck yeah. All right, let's get into the second one. Oh, uh, God. Mm. So. Fuck! That feels like you took my tongue on fire. I have a question. So all your friends, and a lot of fans even know you as Chondo. And I feel like I've known that nickname since I met you. Um, where did that come from? Or is that just like a weird name that you came up with once? Oh, fuck. This is a bad idea. You do know that, right? What? Being called Chando? Or? No, this whole thing. <laughs> Shit. Mm. Also, I just want to point out that before we started, he said he didn't want a drink. And I had to just put it on the table for him just in case. And I guess that was a good idea. Oh, fuck. Okay. You're not going to make this. Mm. <laughs> I'm going to finish it. So, Sad Man John Doe. Hold on. Okay. Uh. 
Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, my favorite wrestler growing up was Man Man Pondo. And I wanted to do oh god, this is terrible. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to do a gimmick in the backyard where I ripped them off very blatantly. And um and uh Sad Man Chando, okay good. Pondo found out about it, asked me about it. Nicest guy ever, hit him with the car. How'd that go when you talked to him about it? Was he like confused by it? Did he think it was cool or? No, he bought me Wendy's after I told him so. It worked out good. <laughs> Wait, how did that happen? Uh, someone booked me against him, some guy. I don't know the guy, you have to look it up. Uh. I don't think I got to the bottom of the story at all, but I feel like I'm not going to. Mm. Also keep in mind, you only get one drink of water throughout the episode and you still got three more wins. Yeah. You're okay. Yeah. That's a thing to do. Oh, no, it's I'll get off my tongue. Ah. Should we get into the next one now? Oh fuck. I'm gonna ask you this one before we get into it. So that way you have time to think oh, about it. It hurts so bad. Uh, oh, this next one. It's called repercussion. It's uh a horrifying color. And uh my gums are fucking burning. I know. <laughs> But as far as I as far as I think, this is the least pleasant of all of them, <laughs> even though it's number three. So I'm gonna ask the question and then we'll get. I'm gonna ask the question and then we'll get to the point. Also, keep in mind I haven't taken a sip of water yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, so I read somewhere online that when you were in high school, I believe, yeah. uh, when you were introduced to people, you would uh, cut your tongue with razor blades. Yeah. Why don't you take a bite of that, <laughs> and then you tell me about how that came about, what happened with that. <sighs> no, fuck you, Louie. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> ah. This one is a bad one. <laughs> oh, I even got the cap on this song, bitch. It's okay, huh? <coughs> that is my least favorite one. Uh, okay. Is the room supposed to be all spinny? Yeah, you're good. Oh, that's gonna happen? Okay. Oh, fuck! <laughs> what if I can't swallow it, but I just let it fit in my mouth? That's probably a terrible idea. Well, fuck! Got the Louie cracking up behind the camera. Oh, oh my fuck. Mm. Shout out to Low Life Louie uh, mm. filming this one for us. As I can't. <laughs> I'll put the rest of my mouth, but I can't. <laughs> oh. So are you going to do the rest of them with me? I'll, do, I'll put them in my mouth. I'll fucking chuck them around like a good little slut, but I ain't doing that. <laughs> That's a reaction. Uh, fuck. Oh my god. I don't want to see you do that anymore, so I'm going to say that you already lost. <laughs> yeah, fuck, keep your $5. But, <laughs> but we're going to finish the interview. No, no, no you don't need them. We are fucking doing this. I'm, I am came here to stick this fucking <laughs> Satan's cock in my mouth and let's do it. I can't have you spitting them all out like that because that's so disgusting. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if that was real from the, the audience. There, it's in my front pocket, we're good. Yeah, please don't <clears throat> put chewed up chicken. <laughs> I'll hide it over there. Remember, talk about the time you used to cut your tongue with razor blades. <laughs> if it makes you feel any better, I'm officially crying. <laughs> Can I turn on this fan? Uh, like, oh my god. You're good, dude. It's like trying to put it out of fire, but there's no... F oh, fuck. Ah. Oh, fuck. Just... <laughs> That's a terrible idea. This is a terrible idea. Oh, no, yep. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, hold on. Follow him. Follow him. Oh, fuck. Chondo, remember when you used to cut your tongue with razor blades? Shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> what, why? Uh, we're getting to the interview. I thought it would be something that people remembered me by. That's really why you did it? Uh, depression. Uh, ah! Oh, fuck. Uh, oh. Listen. Where's the fucking cold water? Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. 
This is horrendous. All right, so the fourth wing is the uh, the rapture. Oh, this is also a really hot. My lips were on fire. Where the? Ah! Oh god, this is. Oh god. So, Chando, the fourth one is um, the rapture. Before I take a bite of this last wing, uh, another or not the last wing. This next question is that you've driven everywhere. Uh, you're a real road dog. You've driven. I've been on plenty of car trips with you. Um, you're also admittedly a terrible driver. Yeah. So uh, if you could, do you have any good like close call stories or anything weird from like when you drove? Mm. Oh my fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh fuck me. Oh this is. Oh my god. I stuck my head in the fucking tub. <laughs> oh, this one sucks. Ah! That one sucks. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, oh. 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 Man up. Oh. <laughs> you can interact. Yeah, there was a couple times when I was driving us back. Like after, oh, fuck. After the double death tournament, uh -huh. I fell asleep in the car and ended up from one side of the road all the way to the other. And you guys didn't even know about it. I was saying, <laughs> me and Matt were in the car, and I think we were both sleeping on Yeah, that's hap that happens all the time. Ah! <laughs> uh, uh, Shit comes out when your lips are locked. Uh, <laughs> right? Ah! Uh, yeah, so me and Matt were in the car for that, and, and my girlfriend, uh, Tara Calloway, also in the car for that one, and you almost killed all of us. So that's, <laughs> that's one I didn't know about. <laughs> yeah. All right. Hell of a show you got going on here. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> What's your favorite match you ever had? That's not a question. I just want to stretch this out now that uh, you're dying so bad. Uh, 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 what was the question? What's the best match you ever had? The best one? Uh, uh, I wrestled got a, a Wait, actually, no. You said you cut yourself with razor blades on the tongue to, so people would remember you. Is that really why you did that? No, I thought it would be something to do. I did it one time at a party because I saw Sivo do it on the Howard Stern show. And, and, and I thought it would be something to do. And, then it got me kicked out of school for seven weeks. It got you kicked? Okay. Yeah. That's a uh, wow. Oh! oh my god. Now I'm going to eat this last wing. <coughs> you good? No. If you're going to throw it, please go I'm back. not going to throw it. Okay. Um, I have a list of things here. I'm going to just straight up grab my notebook on this one. You're going to ask the question that I'm going to eat the wing. <sighs> I put it all in my mouth, that's close enough. What do you think? Do you think that was a good strategy for anybody else who might do this show? Yeah, yeah, go for it. It's like Rocky Five, go for it. I'm gonna say that's a terrible idea. Um, I'm also fucking hurting though. Ooh. Who's a better person than you? <laughs> uh, Next place. I'm, I got this list here. Oh, God. I want you to rank the pain. If I could lactate right now, I would <laughs> suck my own titty so hard. <laughs> and it killed me. <laughs> I may want to get a job, so I don't know whether to actually grab the titty and try and get something out of it or not. Oh god, I'm woozy. Oh, fuck. John does want to get bookings out of something. <laughs> yeah, if, if people want to book you, <laughs> where do they get you? Just hit me up on Facebook. Well, that's not going to actually, you know, let's save the plugs. I'm going to do that at the end. I have this list uh, here. It's so many of the spots that I've seen you do that, in my opinion, were probably the dumbest uh, and most painful. Uh, I want you to rank the pain and maybe uh, you can tell us a little bit about each one because uh, we, we have the time. Um, from from worst to least, you know, to, to they're all miserable. They're all going to be miserable. Uh, I'm going to eat this wing while we do it. Which one's the worst one? That bright red one. Before you put it in your mouth. Uh, Connor Claxton putting a Kenzin in your foot at the first survival of the sickest. Uh, Madman Pondo at an H2O show hitting you with your own car. Oh. Uh, the time that I threw you off the top rope onto a shopping cart on the floor. Or this. Now but take a bite and then you rank those and tell me about each one. Fuck. Hey, we're going to the top. We're going to the top. Do you remember what the list was? Yeah, I do. <laughs> ah. I don't know if I come to the winner or not. Ah. Oh, fuck it. 
Uh, it's, not, uh, it's only hot water. <laughs> it doesn't work. It doesn't work at all. Fuck. Oh, that's hot water. So, Kenzin in the foot, uh, getting hit by a car. The Kenzin in the foot didn't hurt because it wouldn't go through my foot, so it put it in my head, and that sucked. The okay. state when you put staples in my foot, you put like four of them. That really hurt. Uh, what about when I threw you onto the shopping cart? Where's that stand? That's probably... Before today, that was probably number one, because I smashed my ankles on the legs of the shopping cart. Oh, God. Um, what about Pondo hitting you with a Why's the water in your place so fucking hot? I don't know. <laughs> this does suck, is that? Uh, Pondo hit me with my car. My car roof's leak. My car roof leaks now. Good. And... And uh, fucking this. Oh fuck. So oh, this is the worst one. Oh god. Um I'd rather push a baby through one of your urethra than do this bullshit. <sighs> now it's fucking <sighs> starting to get me. <sighs> so don't touch me. You kinda <sighs> <laughs> You hitting me just made it hurt more on me. Yeah. Uh, you kind of ate some of them. I don't know if I count that as a win. In all honesty, would you count that as a win? I'm going back to the shower. No, I gotta go in here. Fine. You know what? All right, so uh, as you just saw, Jimmy Lyon uh, has lost at the flaming table. Um, I was asking little low life Louie Jr. what he thought, but I realized you were drinking out of the shower, which is more than your one allotted drink. Now you have your milk. That's fine. Um, but since you lost, I need you to cut a promo on this little guy, Felix. He's only got three legs. And just tell him how much better he is than you. <laughs> I would job to Felix any day. I probably will end up jobbing that's to not Felix. A pro that's not a promo. Oh, you, you want a promo? Yeah, please. In character. In character? Okay, we're just going to cut there. Can we just start over? All right, we're gonna start over then. So uh, as we just saw, Jimmy Lyon, uh, not only did he not finish all the wings, but he also drank out of the shower, uh, my kitchen sink, my bathroom sink, and everything. So he tapped out to the flaming table, and now uh, he has to cut a quick promo on this guy, Felix, who's probably horrified of you because you were screaming. Uh, let him know how much better he is than you. Listen, Felix. You may only have three legs. You, you may have a nice place to sit and eat and sleep at night. And you may think you're better than me, but boy, once I get you inside that cage, you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to make you wish that only having three legs was your worst problem. Felix, enjoy the pets now, because I'm about to run all over that ass. All right. Now, really, he was supposed to put the cat over as being better than him, but I'll take that because it was weird. Uh, do you have anything you want to plug before we get out of here? Uh, plug his asshole. <laughs> I'd like to plug my asshole. Plug some milk. It's right up there. Where can people get in touch with you and things like that? The local hospital after this. <laughs> uh, hit me up on Instagram. No, I don't have this. Don't don't hit me up on Instagram. Uh, hit me up on Facebook if you want to book me. I don't know why either. Uh, and uh, Jimmy Chondo line. Try and buy pictures for me because when I'm not doing dumb shit like this, I draw pictures and I need money. Cause, that is true. Yeah, yeah that's true. And um, double sound video because I make money from that. And uh, yeah, and I just like to say you're just as bad of a person when, now as you were when I first met you. Great, thank you. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Tell everybody about these videos. You can follow us on Twitter, Instagram, everything. It's The Flaming Table. Thank you very much. Call the police because this is probably illegal.